Hey everyone! Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a really popular and effective way to organize your data in a data lakehouse, the Medallion Architecture. You might have heard of it, especially if you're working with platforms like Databricks or Microsoft Fabric. So, what exactly is the Medallion Architecture? Basically, it's a data design pattern, kind of like a blueprint, for structuring your data in a lakehouse. The main goal is to improve the quality of your data step by step as it moves through different stages. Think of it as a pipeline where data gets cleaner and more refined at each stop. It was a concept really popularized by Databricks, and sometimes you'll hear it called a multi-hop architecture. The architecture is divided into three main layers, often referred to by colors representing their quality. First, we have the bronze layer. This is your raw data zone. When data first comes into your lakehouse, whether it's from batch processes or streaming sources like Kafka, it lands here without really any cleaning or transformation. As the diagram shows, it's the raw integration or landing zone for raw data, no schema needed. You're basically saving the data as is, preserving the original state. This is super valuable because it means you always have the raw source if you need to go back or reprocess anything. Next is the silver layer. This is where the magic of cleaning and conforming starts to happen. Here, you take the raw data from the bronze layer and apply light transformations. This isn't about heavy aggregation yet, but rather cleaning, filtering out bad data, standardizing formats, and maybe augmenting it slightly to make it more usable. The diagram calls this filtered, cleaned, augmented, and mentions you, define structure, enforce schema, evolve schema as needed. You're making the data more structured and validated, creating a more unified view of your business entities. Finally, we reach the gold layer. This is your refined, business-ready data. In this layer, you perform aggregations and enrichments to meet specific analytics and reporting requirements. This data is typically structured for performance and ease of use by downstream teams like business intelligence analysts, data scientists, or machine learning engineers. It's the business-level aggregates stage, ready to deliver continuously updated, clean data to downstream users and apps, for BI and ML as the diagram illustrates. The Medallion architecture has some great advantages. It provides a simple and logical flow for data cleanliness that's easy for teams to understand. Because you keep the raw data in the bronze layer, you can always regenerate any downstream tables if needed. However, it's not a silver bullet. It doesn't replace the need for good data modeling within each layer. It can also use a fair bit more storage because you're keeping multiple copies of the data at different stages. And sometimes, analysts might need to do further transformations on the gold layer data for specific reports. Plus, it really is designed with a data lakehouse environment in mind. But overall, the Medallion architecture provides a clear, structured, and effective way to manage and improve the quality of your data as it moves through your system, making it more reliable and useful for everyone. Have you used the Medallion architecture? What are your thoughts on it? Let me know in the comments below. And if you found this explanation helpful, please hit that like button and subscribe for more tech insights. Thanks for watching.